Hello and welcome to Home Cooking Spain. Today I'm going to be cooking fish with peppers and onions. So let's begin. So I'm going to turn the stove on and I'll turn it up to number seven and I'll just add about three tablespoons of olive oil. And we'll wait for that to heat up. By the way, today we're going to be eating these with Galician style potatoes. I'll leave a link in the description for the recipe to that. And I've already got here my chopped up peppers, onion and garlic. You can use more or less, it's up to you. And I've also got some nice pieces of hake fish. Look at the size of them, beautiful. And I've cut the sides off and these are defrosted. I left them overnight in the fridge. Once the oil is hotish, I'm going to add everything in. Everything meaning the vegetables. And I'm just going to gently fry this. I don't want to brown it off or anything. I just want to, I'm going to, wait a minute, I'm going to cover it up because that way the steam will help everything to go soft, which is how I want it. And every now and then, I'll just move everything about until they are all nice and soft. Can't forget the lid. Well, this should be all, oops, nice and soft, yes, lovely. So the next step would be, I'm going to sprinkle some salt in. And I'm going to chuck in the fried tomato. Got, wait a minute. And I'll just give this the snip. Ouch. And we'll just chuck it all in there. And I'll add some water to this. We'll give it a good shake. There's still plenty of tomato in the sides. And I'll also, I'm going to crumble in a fish stock cube. This should be easy to crumble in. It's the meat one that's very sticky. Yeah, look at that. Lovely. And we'll move this about. And we'll leave it there for about five minutes, covered up again. Well, so after about five minutes, what I'll do is chuck in the fish. This will slow the boiling right down, but it'll soon pick up. Oh, not too bad. And I'll cover it back up again. And leave it there for five minutes again. Remember, I'm using number setting medium-high. You probably know by now that I like using medium-high while I cook. I just can't be bothered to turn it up and down every now and then. Well, after five minutes, what I'll do is turn the fish over and yes this is smelling really good oh yes and I'll cover it back up again 
I'll leave it there for another five minutes. Well, so the other five minutes have gone by, and this is ready. Beautiful. So what I'll do now is I'll turn the stove off and just leave it there to rest for five minutes and then I'll dish it up. Well, and here is the result. A delicious fish with peppers and onions in a fried tomato sauce. And I think I forgot to mention, if you don't have hake, you can use any other fish. I would go for cod. I love cod, but it's too expensive here, so I use hake, which is just as delicious. So, thank you very much for watching, and I look forward to sharing my next recipe video with you. Thanks once again, and goodbye.